pretty psychic, so generally with you know a, a band that's my band and people that I'm connected to, like I can just go on and, and feel what they're feeling. You know, I really try to be empathetic and know what Sean's feeling and why he's doing what it is, and even trying to tap into the memories that made him go there and and all of that. So first and foremost, I try to hold that space because um, I think that keeps it true to the song. You know, I know my favorite songs when. I didn't know the lyrics first and I heard the music and it made me feel this certain way and then I figured out the lyrics and they explained exactly how I was feeling and there was that a, a cool thing there for me so that's mostly what I try to do and then I try to be appropriate to to, to whatever's going on so I think at first I just played a djembe on that track to, to get the, the main feel of it. When we recorded it I played the drum set part and the djembe part simultaneously and then re-recorded uh, an udu and a cajon over top of it to try to make it feel like it wasn't just one drummer either. That it, was, it was maybe a village. Or a